G'day there everyone, Daniel Anderson here. Now we all know the value of using metadata in our document libraries to track additional information uh, on our documents. Um, now the SharePoint document libraries in the browser really do give us a, a rich um, set of capabilities in that regard. Now oftentimes though, uh, there are users and people that still wanna sync those document libraries to their computer so that they can access the content via File Explorer, for example. Obviously, we can't bring that metadata and the, the views and the document library features and functionalities uh, to File Explorer, but the metadata actually still is accessible from the files themselves. So there's a little hidden, um, I guess, unknown properties button inside of, and we're going to have a look at Word in just a sec, that allows us to interact and change the metadata, the SharePoint metadata, on the document library from within that Word document itself. So let's jump in and have a look and I'll show you where we can do that. So I'm in a, a simple document library here. We've got a couple of additional metadata columns over and above just the out of the box ones. So we've got a review date and we've got a document type. Now I have also synchronized uh, this document library to my PC. So you can see here that I've got a demo document library that's sitting under the Contoso tenant here um, and it's share uh, synchronized to my computer. So you can see that we've got uh, this policy document. It's got a review date and it's got a document type of policy. Now, if I'm accessing that document from my file explorer, then I might want to adjust that metadata. Now, it doesn't have to be these columns, it could be any of the other columns. Now, I've opened the document inside of Word. Now, under the View tab of Word in the desktop client, we've got this option here in the ribbon under SharePoint called Properties. Now that's gonna slide out a panel on the right-hand side. And what that's going to load is the SharePoint properties. So you can see here we've got title, we've got review date, uh, category is uh, another column that's associated to a content type in that library, and we've got document type. So we might wanna change this to a different type of document, let's say, or change the metadata. So let's go to and change employee referral. So you can see now that what's going to happen, it's going to kick off a save, and I'm just going to double uh, make sure that we save that. So that's now saved. I'm gonna jump back to the document library now, and you can see here, here's the policy. It's set to policy. Now I'm just gonna speed things up and we'll refresh this page. And you can see there that it's now changed to employee referral. So we've changed the metadata from within the Word uh, client application. So although you don't get the rich user experience of a SharePoint document library in File Explorer, there are some, there are, there is that way that you can interact and change and adjust the meta, the SharePoint metadata that is associated to that particular document. So I hope that brings you some value. Thanks for watching and see you next time.